In the modern era, no five-star football prospect has ever committed to an HBCU. What it is until Coach Prime. I appreciate all my teammates for helping me, helping me get to where I'm at. I appreciate y'all for just pushing me every day and showing that y'all following my footsteps and wishing me to be great. I thank all the coaches, especially Coach Fontaine, for taking me in as a freshman. Since day one, he's seen something in me that nobody else seen. This ever always come to pick me and make sure I have someone to eat, make sure I have someone to stay every night. Because when I first got up there, I really didn't have no friends. I really just came up and just thought football, football, no schoolwork or nothing. And I really thank Dr. Chuck and Ms. Williams for actually helping me and looking out for me in my classes, really pushing me to get my grades up. And I want to thank Coach Gray for just always trusting the whole team and trusting me to be the leader of this class. I want to thank Coach Dante, Coach Warfare. I want to thank all the coaches just for really pushing me and pushing me to be the great and be who I am today. That being said, I want to work out the best I can. Florida State, but this is a real bit too, but that ain't my choice. This is a real bit too, but I'm, I'm gonna say that for later. Uh, I like this one. It fit me well, but that ain't who I want. Always been on my mind, but check me out, mom. Don't be that happy. Yeah, you heard me correctly. Five-star prospect Travis Hunter has committed to Jackson State University, man. Bro, he could be the number one overall wide receiver or the number one overall DB. That's just how good he is. He takes so much time into his craft, whether it's in-season or off-season. The man is training two to three times, four times a week, man. Some people are going to say, oh, it's a bag. Come on, man. Don't be that guy. You feel me? Don't be him. This is a major move in the right direction. No, 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 what? Scratch that. This is a major leap in the right direction. A five-star prospect has just come and put all of the eyes on Jackson State University, in addition to what Coach Prime should do with Shiloh, all the new guys brought in this season. I don't think most people understand how much media coverage a five-star prospect really gets on their own. Oh, you thought it was a lot of new media outlets last year? No, it's about to be a lot of new media outlets this year, man. Travis comes with his own circus basically if you don't know how a lot of scouts are viewing him as a player think of lebron james in his sport he's that dominant at his position whether it be wide receiver or db based on how a receiver lines up he already knows this route is out this route is out this route is out and then based on film study from there this is what they like to run at this down in distance okay this is this tail of this wide receiver he's a student of the game when a player of this caliber commits, a lot of the times other players follow that lead because they want to compete with and against this guy every day. I feel like this is the start of something beautiful, man. Jackson State may just pull off a top 25 class, which is scary, bro. And this is just the first one. Let's see what else happens. Cut day out.